A vertical church is not a horizontal church. A horizontal church begins with this question. That's what most people are familiar with. What's a, what's a horizontal church? It's a church that says, what do the people like? How do we get people to come? And once the people, the crowd comes, what do we need to do to keep the crowd coming? A vertical church doesn't ask those questions. Vertical church says, what does he like? How do we get him to come? And when God comes, what do we need to do to keep him coming? Because when he comes, it's a whole different deal. And a vertical church has four distinguishing characteristics. First of all, it's about unashamed adoration, real worship. I'm not talking about music or singing. I'm talking about worship, and there's a big difference. Second thing in a vertical church is unapologetic preaching. It's not right-wing, mean-spirited, hellfire and brimstone preaching, but it is preaching that's based solidly in the Word of God. The third characteristic is unceasing prayer. At Restoration, we believe prayer is the engine of the church. I'm not just a praying pastor. We have raised up a praying church. And on Tuesday nights in the congregation, we pray. Saturday mornings, we pray. Sunday morning, really throughout the week, there's all kinds of opportunities because prayer is the engine of the church. And then lastly, it's about unafraid witness. Now, what do I mean by that? Let me tell you, we don't have an evangelism program. We don't sit down and train people how to tell people, their friends about the Lord. What's happening in a vertical church, when God shows up, people have to tell their neighbors, their family, their coworkers, and that's exactly what's happening. People are inviting strangers, friends, families, even enemies, going, you gotta come experience my church. And so that's what a vertical church is. If you've never experienced a vertical church, let me tell you, when God shows up, it, it's like heaven on earth. It's truly life-changing.